Hey guys, welcome to my channel if you are new and if you've been here already, welcome back. My name is Drusilla Shea, if you don't know already. If you have seen my last video, you would see that quite a few things in my closet don't fit me anymore. So I had to just rectify the situation stat. I picked up things from Primark, H&M, and Zara and I'm gonna be showing them all to you guys today. I went to the American Dream Mall for the first time in New Jersey. Wow, that mall is so big and it's so well lit. We didn't even get to see the whole mall. That's how big it was. We were there for several hours and it was also my first time at Primark. I've been wanting to go to Primark for years. So enough of my rambling. I'm going to show you guys what I picked up. Now, just for some context, if you see my latest video, you know that I'm looking for things that are more stretchy and things that are not as constricting unless they're stretchy. Like I don't mind something that's like a legging, for example, because it's stretchy, but it still is fitted. And I'm looking for things that are also very loose and like airy, things that if my weight were to shift, I would be able to still fit into. So I got a few things from Zara, including this pencil skirt, super stretchy, lightweight. It's really not like a extremely thick fabric, but it still feels like decent quality. So I'm happy about that. I'm going to try this on for you guys in a second, but I want to show you guys the rest of the things that I got from Zara. So I also picked up this crop top. It's like this nice tangerine color. Once again, a very stretchy top. I think that is so perfect for the summer and especially if you're going on vacation and you wanna wear like some bright colors. I think that this is so cute. And then I saw this little bad boy at the checkout. Now this is like a netted shirt, also very stretchy. And it's a crop top. And once I saw this, I thought vacation. I just feel like it screamed cover up. So let me try it on for you guys so you can see. We have the tangerine top that I was talking about and the red pencil skirt. It's nice and long and I love that. It's very, very stretchy. I really don't have any concerns about not fitting into it if I were to gain a little bit of weight. And then this top, like look at this. It's so cute. I love the color. The color on my skin tone. Mm orange and melanin always hits different i didn't get these two to pair them but when i picked them both up i was just like oh this could be a good combo so i just wanted to show you guys how they look together let me know what you guys think down below about all of these pieces and of course i will definitely try my best to link everything that i can find online for you guys down in the description box but if i can't find it online sorry in advance Alrighty guys, so here is the netted top. I have a bandeau under this, but like I said, I plan on wearing this as a cover up. So chances are I'm gonna have a bathing suit underneath this. I love this design. I feel like it just screams vacation, as you guys can tell. I'm clearly ready to catch some flights, okay? I'm ready to be on somebody's beach. Now something I do have to say about Zara though, this time around, I don't know why, but like the sizing with everything was just so weird. And it wasn't just with me, like my best friend said the same thing. Nothing was fitting us. And we had to keep like sizing up like one or two sizes and things still weren't fitting. And then there were also some things that we had to like go down a size. It was just really weird. Anyway, I feel like this whole trend of really cute and bright and colorful crop tops are coming out and I'm here for it. This one has buttons in the front and it's sleeveless. So I'm gonna try this out for you guys to see. Here is the shirt. Now I decided to button it all the way up. You can just style it up however you like, you know, if you wanna open it up, that's also an option. You can even fold this down and it'll just look like it has a collar. So I really feel like it's, it's, it's bringing some versatility, okay? It's bringing something different to the table. This is also incredibly stretchy. So again, I'm gonna be safe in terms of sizing with this. So guys, that's it for all of my Zara picks. Now I'm going to move on to all of my H&M finds. I found some culottes and shout outs to the person who told me how to pronounce it the proper way because in my last video I was butchering it but I was told it's culottes. So I found some culottes at H&M and they're almost like a linen material I would say and nice and light and airy. Now you guys saw that I had to let go of my former culottes. But this one has a stretchier waist. So I'm just feeling like this this might be a long termer. So I'm gonna try it out for you guys to see. Alrighty guys, here are my culottes. You know it's giving bougie auntie vibes and I 
love it they're definitely looser than my last pair so i'm really excited about that and i just feel like it's bringing airy summer vacation vibes can't you just imagine the warm summer breeze just flowing through this material okay it's just giving me summer it has pockets we love an item with pockets here we have a high-waisted pair of off-white shorts and loose at the waist so you know i can appreciate that at this stage of my life i'm gonna just try this out for you guys to see Alrighty, guys here are my white high-waisted shorts we're giving airy and light once again okay those are the vibes i was going for it's super comfortable guys like i barely feel that it's on except for the waist it's not that it's tight but because it does have the elastic clearly i'm gonna feel that against my skin but other than that everything is just like off the skin you know so just very breathable which i can appreciate in the summer i'm here for it now for the last pair of shorts that i got from h m i've been wanting these for a whole year now not this specific short but like this style so it's pretty much like a looser boy style short funny thing is that i thought that something that would look like a boy short would look better if it came from the men's section so i picked one up for the men's section it looked horrible it looked absolutely horrible okay it was too straight so it didn't flatter me at all but they had a similar style in the women's section and they did it right okay they did it right i just want to wear it with like a tank or a bodysuit and then wear this on top and go run some errands go to costco okay go to target whatever grown woman errands i need to run so i'm just gonna show you guys how it looks on me all right guys so here are these shorts on me now i'm so happy that i found this style in the women's section because as you guys can see it almost like comes up more or comes in more rather on the middle section area and then it kind of slightly comes out and this is actually a little bit more girly than i was intending to go but it worked out and i love that it's actually quite high-waisted i'm definitely ready to run some errands in these cash me at costco how about that all right guys so clearly i was really in an orange mood colors like this are around everywhere because this is from zara this is from H&M. I've really been liking this whole collared trend coming back around. And the fact that they are coming out with like bright, colorful colors <laughs> is definitely bringing 60s vibes. So um, I caught this dress and I was like, oh, I have to try this on. So I'm going to try this out for you guys to see. Alrighty guys, I know that we're trying on clothes and whatnot, but I'm gonna just have to pause real quick and ask you guys to go ahead and hit that red subscribe button. I mean, you've been here for some time now, you might as well. And while you're in that vicinity, go ahead and please turn on your bell notification button so that anytime I post, you will be up to date. All right guys, back to these clothes. Mm, mm. Let me gather myself because I'm too hype right now. I'm so hype over this dress for a lot of different reasons. First of all, color, like I said, bomb. On top of that, we talking flexible, we talking stretchy, okay? This dress is so incredible. I mean, you, you wouldn't want to stretch it out this much, right? Because the buttons. But just saying that it's extremely flexible. So even if I were to gain a little bit of weight, I still feel like this would fit me fine also loving the length perfect for the springtime my best friend saw this dress she gave me an idea once she saw this dress she was like this is really giving her 60s vibes catch the picture she painted okay because i wasn't ready tall white boots right boom 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 think about like austin powers vibes have like the hairstyle where it's like flipped over or just like one of those 60s hairstyles then she threw in the sunglasses that have like the white rim i was just like oh my goodness i don't know why i didn't think about that but that is so perfect for this dress because it's really giving like austin power vibes is that what they used to do something i do have to tell you if you're looking into buying this is that it is a little bit see-through so you want to watch the undergarments that you wear and make sure that it is skin tone colored this is also an extremely lightweight material which means that anything bulky underneath will show but it's still a really cute dress don't you think next up we have this i think it's meant to be a dress but um i'm gonna wear it with biker shorts underneath i'll show you guys how that looks it has shoulder pads it's sleeveless and again the collars like collars are back they are giving what they need to get let me try this out for you guys to see Alrighty guys, so I just wanted to 
show you guys real quick how this looks just as a dress it's just a very nice loose dress another linen material and the shoulders man the shoulders give them shoulders real quick okay Hey, how shape for me. Sorry guys, I had a moment. These are um just like a cool detail, I feel, because it just makes this not so typical and regular anymore. It like upgrades it. It's giving you the collar, it's giving you the little detail over here, okay? And it's just nice and loose. Like I love how airy it is. I have intentions on wearing this a little differently, so I'm gonna put it on the way I plan on wearing it to show you guys. Okay guys, so this is more of the kind of vibe that I was trying to go for. I definitely am seeing this with like a sandal heel of some sort. I do have these new lace up sandal heels. Let me go get them and just try them on so you guys can get the whole outfit. We're bringing fashionable bougie auntie vibes and I'm here for it. I just want to do something a little bit more different. And by the way, these shoes are from Lonia, which is a shoe brand that provides shoes for women who are US women size 10 to 15, okay? And their stuff is actually fashionable. I have a discount code for you guys. Drusilla 20. I think I'm gonna end up showing you guys the last look that I got from H&M, even if that means struggling to get it over my head. Okay guys, so I'm totally not wearing the appropriate bra for this. Sorry about that. But this is just like a little shirt that I wanted to pick up for date night with hubby. I didn't zip it up either and I'm honestly considering taking it back only because this just fits, but I feel like any weight that I gain, it's not gonna zip anymore. I just don't feel like struggling with clothes anymore. I really don't. Alrighty guys, so next up we have an item from Primark. I am definitely, definitely going back to Primark and I'm going to splurge in that store. Why? Because everything is just so low priced and fashionable. They have really good stuff and pretty good quality. I am not disappointed in the quality of anything that I picked up, so. Hi Mark, okay? Anyway, I picked up these culottes. They're not as thick as sweatpant material, but they are more of like a sweater cotton material. It has a very, very loose waistline. Now, don't be deceived by this. This is not adjustable. This is the only downside I don't really like about it. It's like, these are not actually functional, but it is still very stretchy and loose. This is another piece that I would wear on my little errand day. I'm gonna try it out for you guys to see. Here are the sweat culottes. It's just so comfortable, guys, so airy. If you want to, you guys can pick these up as loungewear, because that's technically what it is. If I were to be getting this at like an H&M, I think I would definitely hit $20. If I was to get this at Zara, I would definitely be hitting 30 plus. We went to Primark first and all the pricing was just like so good, so low price. And then we went to Zara right after that. It was just like literally night and day. The pricing is just so different. There were certain things that were from Primark that we saw similar ones at Zara and we compare the pricing and it's just like so much more expensive at Zara. So just put y'all on, okay? Primark is the plug. They do have good quality things and nice fashionable things at very, 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 like as a matter of fact, Primark, y'all need to be sponsoring me. So these pants, super comfortable. They have pockets, guys. We love the functionality of that. I would definitely honestly buy this in different colors. And now let's move on to the next item. These are black faux leather shorts. I'm, I'm gonna just try it on for you guys to see. Alrighty, peeps. Look at what we have here. I always think that this has pockets, but it doesn't. I think it's perfect for right now because the weather is still very inconsistent. So some days it's actually still a little bit cool. It's giving you classy vibes. It's giving you bougie auntie vibes. I love the length because of the full leather material. It can be really perfect with sneakers if you're trying to do like a streetwear look. And it can be really perfect with some sandal heels if you're trying to get dressed up. Versatility. That was the last clothing item that I picked up from my shopping trip, but I did get a couple accessories from Primark. So I was on my way to the cash register and I peeped this bad boy. I plan on using it for like a beach day or some type of like park outing or something. Guess how much this is? Before I even tell you, 
guess how much this is I'm gonna tell you afterwards so I picked this up right before I went to the cash register by the time I got to the cash register where my friend was she was like oh my goodness you got this here she like ran to go get it and then when my friend went to go get it this lady who was in front of me in line was just like oh you got this here like same thing and so clearly this bag is catching a lot of attention and it was catching a lot of attention in the store but this cost seven buckaroos and they also have this in a very clear color so this is like tinted dark gray and then they have like a straight up clear like see-through bag like think about saran wrap i'm telling you guys the same things that we began from other stores that cost an arm and a leg you go to Primark, you get it for half the price. Last but not least, I bought these sunglasses from Primark. I think this is a tortoiseshell design and I just really love the shape of it and I just like the fact that it's like a nice yellowish color and I feel like it'll go with a lot of things in my summer wardrobe. I was trying to take off the packaging without taking off the packaging, if that makes sense. Like I didn't want to rip it. I don't know, I'm weird like that. I like to keep my packaging on until I wear something like then I'll take it off. Do you guys do that? Please let me know. I wanna know if I'm the only one that does that. Here's how these sunglasses look on me. Ooh, oh, 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 oh. Tell me this don't look like bougie auntie. Like I was just, I'll just pull up to the scene, you know? Oh, hi darlings. <laughs> I feel like they have a fun but also like classy balance to it you know what i'm saying this costs a solid three dollars and fifty cents and it feels solid okay like wow i'm so impressed with primark you guys have no idea how i'm gonna go in the next time i go to that store let me know down below guys if you guys want to specifically see a primark haul all right guys i am done trying on all my new things so i'm gonna wrap this video up so this is just the start of my newer wardrobe and I'm definitely going to be doing some online shopping. I've done some online shopping already so I may show you guys that here or on Instagram so be sure to follow me there. Let me know down below if any of these pieces were your favorite. Also do not forget to subscribe before you leave okay I'm clocking you and please do turn on your bell notifications so that anytime I post you'll be up to date. It's been real guys thank you for coming with me on this journey. And I will see you guys in my next video next Sunday. Deuces.